Welcome back guys, it's Blade, and we are still in Outlast, the Whistleblower. I'm still looking for a freaking valve. I don't know where this dude went that is chasing me. Hey, sweet. I'm trying to get away from him. I was like looking for any and every possible escape route and I apparently found it. That's awesome. Gash room. Yay. Another battery? Very helpful. I'm gonna shut that door just in case. Oh wait, valve. <laughs> there we go, okay. Achievement unlocked gas leaker. Okay, and crap. Hmm, this is also going to suck. Okay, I have decent amount of battery. Okay. Now I need to try and get past this guy once more. Not seeing anything out of the ordinary down here. Oh, uh, there you are. You can't. You can't smell me. I'm hoping this is the right way. Sorry, come on. Hey, it was the right way. Cool. Oh man, finally out of here. At least this part. Whoa. Loading screen. <laughs> okay. Ah, we are heading down lower and lower. That's never good. And that's just a dead end, apparently. Ah, the freaking lag spikes, jeez. Oh, we're... We're outside. Okay, this is cool. That's cool. <laughs> We're at least not in that freaking building. It is so foggy. Holy Jesus. The door open right here. Apparently. Please let this be leading away from this asylum. Oh, what the fuck? I don't know what that was. Okay, um... A random dude that's apparently coming after me. I think that's what that was to begin with, actually, was some random dude came up to me and just like hit me in the back of the head or something. Oh my god. Freaking nice spikes. 
Oh crap. Ooh, another battery. Cool. Oh yeah, ah, crap, where do I go? <laughs> I think I just literally put myself in a dead end. Oh my god. Um, uh oh. <laughs> Playing basketball, I don't think. Oh, yeah, you are? Okay. That's honestly kind of cool. Unfortunately, we weren't heading away from here, which I was hoping, but this is cool. Okay. Unfortunately, I don't know where I'm going. This is a prison block. Ah, oh, well, great. <laughs> Is there somewhere else I need to go? Because I can't get through here, apparently. Nothing I can do with these. Can't even jump onto them. Okay, use the shortwave radio in the prison. So I've gotten to the prison. Oh, hi, dude. Right, I guess I actually need to go into here, not the other one. Okay. That makes a bit more sense. A random security guard. Okay. Oh, hi. <laughs> I don't know what that was. Okay, what is actually down here? I don't think I should be worried about that at all. Or maybe I should be. I think that's where I'm supposed to go. Mm, I didn't want that to be where I was supposed to go. Crap. Ah, oh, jeez. Okay. Whatever. I wonder if I'm ever going to see blue skies because I see it looks like a sky right there. It is so foggy around here that I can barely see anything anyways. Okay. Felix. I would like to kill him. Hi, dude. You are very naked. <laughs> Very much naked. I am going to close this just in case. Uh, any batteries of any kind? There's apparently some dude that got his head chopped off right here. No batteries, really? Looks like he was lifting weights, and I'm guessing the weights probably came crashing down on him or something. I'm not sure. 
Did I literally just end up out in the same spot that I was avoiding? Shit. Oh, not good. Not freaking good. Those are the guys that said that they wanted to kill me. Uh, and they're both very naked. Yeah, it looks like they're following me though. Oh shit. Ah, um. Ow. Dressing skins or fuck off. I can't go through there. Okay. Heading higher up now. That's better. Alright, they can deal with the big guys. I don't want to. Ah, of course. Of course that door would be locked. Oh, there's a document here. Sweet! And that was it. Okay. Is it locked from the inside? Yeah. Right, I should say on the inside, not from the inside. Okay. The Wall Rider Delusion. Okay, Kurt, we've got another one, and I'm not sure you're going to be able to check it off as Psychopathic Proximity Disorder. Security Guard all the way up in the admin block is our latest non-patient employee to start seeing Wernick's fairy tales. He was never directly exposed to the engine, never even made it below level 1 in the building. It would be enormous, uh, an enormous breach of protocol and security if doctors were speaking of the wall rider within hearing of a contracted security guard and seems vanishingly improbable that he would stumble onto such an obscure mythological story of his own. It's too similar to the Dr. Samuel case or the others before him. It's one thing for uh, formerly sane medical per personnel to fall under the delusions of their patients. It's another thing entirely for those beliefs to be, I don't know, airborne. We need to talk in person. Billings. Okay. So now there's a guy named Billings, or someone. I'm sorry, what? What am I listening to? <laughs> Oh, you are going to die. Oh, shit. Pretty sure I should be worried about that, but... There's a random dude up there. I would probably mistaken him for a guard, honestly. <laughs> And no way am I going up there. At least not yet. <laughs> I was hoping there would be a battery in there. Apparently not. I'm gonna hope he's not one of those ones that's also trying to kill me. It's not. They were waiting for us in this place. Billy understood. 
They've always been here. So he has broken shackles on. He's apparently not trying to kill me or anything, which is cool. Looks like I finally have a friend for once. Okay. So no batteries or anything. That's like all I Oh shit. That didn't look good. I can hear something really bad happening to them. Okay. That's definitely not a room I would really appreciate to be in. <laughs> Okay. No, oh, thank you. <laughs> now we can all know what is through that place in the next video. So thank you all so much for watching. If you guys have enjoyed watching me play through Outlast the Whistleblower, and definitely be sure to leave a like rating. Also, if you guys would like to see more, please be sure to subscribe. It is only one simple click of a button away. And I will see all you ladies and gentlemen in the next episode.